Okay, did you build your Wix website and you felt great about it, you published it, and then you noticed that you have this like huge white blank space on one or all of your pages? I notice this all the time with clients who kind of did it themselves, that they end up with these like weird extra spaces somewhere on their page. I'm going to show you how you can quickly fix that and get rid of that extra space in just a click or two. Um, Hop into your Wix editor and then navigate to the page that you want to adjust. This is the homepage of this particular website, so I'm already there, but if it was a different page, I would navigate using this menu here. And then we're going to use this feature that's called Zoom Out and Reorder. Now, I always build my Wix sites using strips so that everything is nice and easy to organize, easy to adjust. Um, you can literally move each strip up and down, you type of thing really easy. So we have zoomed out and we are going to find the spot on our site where we have all this extra space. So um, I noticed that this is one strip right here and I can't adjust the height of this in this where I am right now, but I can definitely, um, it's good to know that there, that's where some extra space is living. But if I keep scrolling down, I'll notice that I have extra space here and you can just click this button and delete it. So that was just extra space that was happening on the page that I didn't need. Um, I'm going to go back into, I'm going to go out of this zoom out mode and I'm going to shorten this right here. And then taking a look, I notice I also have, um, some extra space down here. So I already took away a big chunk of my white blank space using that feature. Um, and now I know where I can find that space on my page. So I'm going to go back down to this strip right here. I didn't build this site. So it's a great example of how these things can happen. Um, and I'm going to select the strip. I can see there's all this extra space below. And I'm going to just click it and drag it up. All right, yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> um, and I like to like, you don't wanna take away too much space because then those items will be too close together. But I do like to give it a better kind of little buffer area. And then you'll notice there's also space happening right here. And this is actually, when I click on it, I can see that this is actually the background of the page. My option here is to change the page background. What I want to do is scroll down and I want to find this little icon here that says adjust page height. I'm going to click that and then I'm going to start dragging the page up. You can't really tell, um, but if I keep doing it, I am bringing this footer design closer to my last strip. And that's something that happens often too. The actual page height needs to be adjusted. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go back out to my zoom out and reorder so I can kind of take a bird's eye view of this and scroll down. And now I notice that big white space is gone and then that big white space on the bottom is also gone. So I wanna go ahead and save that. I'm gonna exit here so that I can also publish the changes that I just made. A lot of times we hop into the editor, we make some changes, we save it, and we forget to publish. So we go back to our live site and we realize, you know, I just did all this work, why can't I see it? Most of the time you just forgot to publish it. So make sure that you publish anytime you've made changes that you want to see on your finished site. While I'm in here, I'm gonna hop over to the mobile preview so that I can take a look and see if there's any weird stuff happening with my spacing here on my mobile site as well. Now this is a site that, a client that I just took on, so I have not touched this website at all yet. I just am kind of doing a few short or quick things so that it's not too crazy before I actually go in and do my own work. Um, and right away you can see there's an opportunity to delete some space there, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then anywhere else that I might see some space that needs to be deleted, I would do that as well. The same thing it looks like is happening here where the page height needs to be adjusted. So I can see that icon as well. I'll go ahead and I'm clicking on it and dragging my mouse upward. So I click it and drag up. And what that's doing is it's shortening the 
height of the page so that I don't have all this extra space. And I've shortened it all the way until I get to the strip. So now that icon has changed, you can see that the blue selection tool is showing me that I have a strip selected. I'm gonna take a little bit of height off of that too, just so that there's not all this extra space in here. And then just that. So I will go ahead and publish that as well. You can do the zoom out and reorder on mobile as well. That looks good. I'm going to exit this, publish, and I hope that that was helpful.